A cross-party parliamentary group says England's rivers are filled with a chemical cocktail of sewage, agricultural waste and plastic, putting public health and nature at risk. In its news report, published on Thursday, the Environmental Audit Committee finds that only 14% of English rivers met good ecological status. Its author writes, It is clear that the rivers in England are in a mess. The report says, Agriculture and water companies are the two biggest polluters. Farm slurry and fertiliser runoff is choking rivers with damaging algal blooms. The report says intensive livestock and poultry farming is putting enormous pressure on particular catchments. Water companies appear to be dumping untreated or partially treated sewage in rivers on a regular basis though they are only allowed to do so in exceptional circumstances. Besides that, urban pollution is also causing huge problems. Wet wipes are clogging up drains and sewage work and they are often coated with chemicals that can harm aquatic life. Huge fatbergs caused by oil and fats from homes and restaurants are being removed from sewers, costing companies and their customers £100 million a year. The report says not a single river in England has received a clean bill of health for chemical contamination. MPs also find the water pollution monitory systems are outdated, underfunded and inadequate. The report recommends that each river should have a designated bathing area by 2025 and water companies should be penalised more heavily for sewage discharge. MPs say bonuses to bosses of water companies that regularly breach raw sewage discharge permits should be limited. The report also recommends new poultry farms should not be permitted in areas where rivers have excess levels of nutrients. Joy Felix, NTD News.